Stan the man. There's one guy I know that really likes Stan Musial. Hello, is this my good friend Don from Don's Field of Dreams cards? Hey, this is Scott from Reindeer Studios. How are you, buddy? Great, great, great. Hey, I have this 59 top Stan Musial 3000 hit card lying around, and I was wondering if you'd be interested in buying it for me for an exorbitant amount of monies. You have five of them. Oh man. Well, if I throw in a marker doodle of Stan Musial, would you be interested? Oh, you want something more complex than that. Okay. What do you have in mind? Mm-hmm. Clemente, too? Mm-hmm. Three hours later. Okay, is that it? All right, man. As long as we're agreed on that exorbitant amounts of monies. Yeah, it's all about the Benjamins, buddy. All right, cool. We got a deal, Don. Why do I have a feeling you're going to forget all this? All right, man. We'll talk to you later. Hey, Superstars, welcome back to the quest for my Holy Grail card. This is my series where I'm trying to sell off worthless cards for exorbitant amounts of money so that I can eventually buy my Grail card, a T206 Cy Young portrait. But to make it work, I'm including some original art. Got to use my cool laser again. But uh, where do I begin on this one? Let's, uh, let's talk about Don a little bit. Don lives reasonably close to me. I'm in Northeast Ohio and he's in Western PA. So we end up hanging out quite a lot, actually going to card shows and baseball games and fun stuff like that. And he's one of my favorite people because he's just a really, really good person. But uh, don't tell him I said that. I don't want it going to his head. Anyway, it is hard to describe what Don wanted. He was kind of specific, but not really specific. He wanted Stan Musial, who's a native Western Pennsylvanianer. Pennsylvanianer? Uh, much like Don. And uh, Roberto Clemente, who played for the Pirates, Don's favorite team. And he wanted them kneeling. I'm a big fan of photos and bats where the guys are kneeling with the bat. I think those are really cool. Because he really likes players kneeling because he's a weirdo. He did provide a photo of Musial, which was used in one of Don's favorite cards, but I had to figure out how to get Clemente in there too. And he wanted it in color, so a charcoal drawing was out. And I know Don likes the artist Craig Krenler, who is very much a realist painter, so I wasn't going to do a silly looking marker doodle. So that meant this needed to be a painting. And I really didn't give Don a choice after that. I was going to do one of my 3D paintings because, because I felt like it. And I really like the old Forbes Field scoreboard, so Don gets that too. Earlier in the summer, Don came out to visit with Nina S. and Bob Lewis, and we all went to see the Guardians play the Tigers. It was kind of cool for them to see Miggy play, and it was cool for Nina and myself to see the Guardians win. Don was a little offended that I never showed any footage of that trip in any of my monthly recaps or whatever, so here's Don and Bob and me walking through the cemetery to get to Progressive Field. And here's a picture of Bob Lewis eating Dippin' Dots. Happy now, Don. It really is a ton of fun going to baseball games with other YouTubers. Cut to a few weeks ago, and Don invites me out to see Albert Pujols and the Cardinals play in Pittsburgh. PNC is one of my all-time favorite ballparks, and you know there's that secret that Don's one of my all-time favorite people. Plus, that whole getting to see Pujols possibly make some history, so it was a no-brainer. But then I thought more about it. Uh, Cardinals, Pirates, Don wants me to make art with Musial and Clemente. It's like he's subtly hinting that he wants me to finally get his piece done and deliver it to him in person or something. In all seriousness, though, I did not tell him that I was working on this or that I would bring it with me. So I'm really looking forward to this kind of uh, surprise reveal. Before we do that, though, I got to tell one of my awful jokes because 
You know, I don't really know why. It's just tradition now, I guess. Uh, but since Clemente was a pirate, I think it's time for a pirate joke. What did the first matey send down the toilet? The captain's log. Okay, how about a bonus joke? Why does a pirate only bury his treasure 18 inches down? Because booty is only shin deep. <laughs> That's enough of that. Let's move on. There's Stan and Roberto. I think it looks pretty rad. Let's hop on over to Pittsburgh to see what Don thinks. The game was last Sunday, unless you're watching this in the future. But I met up with Dean from Dean Gerhardt. Yeah, I collect that. And Don and his son. Here's what going to a baseball game with a bunch of YouTubers looks like. Here is Albert Pujol striking out. And then everybody booing Don. That seems kind of harsh. And here's the video that Don's son took of Pujols hitting number 697 to overtake A-Rod for fourth place on the all-time home run list. So incredibly awesome to get to see that in person. After the game, we walked back to our cars and... Remember when I called you on the phone? Oh, yeah, I yeah. sold you that that's card, cool. and you're oh, like, why right. are you giving yeah. me... Why, why do you want... I, I forgot it was You were like, I have that card already. That's just this. It, yeah. Yeah. I have like five of these. You want it back? No. You sure? No. Okay. You paid I'm for it. Gonna... Here. Uh, I'm following in the George footsteps. I didn't even tell you who I want. <laughs> Oh, George, yours sucks compared to this. Oh, I can't even talk, man. Gosh. Oh, my God, man. This is a bro hug. Thank you, man. Aw, oh, bro hugs. I should have enlisted Dean to shoot this reveal footage for me as it was kind of difficult, but I may do. A little bit closer. We are almost there. This journey has been nothing short of amazing. Not only the Grail Quest, but the YouTube thing as a whole. I'm just having the time of my life. So uh, thank you, Don, for asking me to do this one and inviting me out and really all you've done for me. As always, thank you guys for watching. And uh, yeah, we will see you next time.